are you? Hey. What are you up to? Oh, gotta get a night of sleep. Ready to bust some A, if you will. Um, You're a little late. I'm sorry. I I had a busy morning, and it, it's just it's been difficult. I'm glad to be here, though. I'm glad you are too. Where's everyone else? I don't know. Um, Mark was supposed to be here, and hello. There she How is. How are you? Sloan's here. Hey, what's up? Okay, so for this robotic web designs project that we're going to have to do, I want to make a how-to web page, diagrams, the materials all the students will need for the class, and also have schematics and pics of robots we've made. What, what does everybody think about that? That, I mean, that, that, sounds, that sounds pretty comprehensive. Does anybody uh, have any other ideas of what we may need, what we don't have yet? I think it's a good thought. Ready to get started. We are told to to go as we see fit. We can make it as widespread, as diverse, as concise as we need to. Maybe we should just wait a few more minutes to start and wait for Mark so we can all do it together. Um, okay. What, what, uh, okay. Hey. Hey, what's up? How's it going? Hi, Mark. Hi. Ah, doing pretty well. How are you? How are you? Pretty good. What you been up to? Uh, just saying I'm not playing. Yeah, things like that happen, even to the best of us, yeah, especially the worst. So, Mark, do you have any ideas as to what we should go with besides what we have up here for the for the web design project? I was just thinking, like, let's screw the whole robotic web design. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's, it's tough. It's so easy. What do you think we should replace half of our grade with? What would be cool? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, we can. What about like robotic web design? Like, what about like really just anything besides robotic web design? But, I mean, how long have you been feeling like that? What about like poker? Poker? Yeah. Poker is illegal. Well, maybe we could use his idea and incorporate somehow like poker theme or something that incorporates that idea. We might not have to do the topic poker because I don't think that would work, but incorporate his idea. I really want to get Mark's idea present and him to feel like he was valued in the group, but his idea about the poker just didn't coincide with our task and our idea, so at the end of the day, it just didn't work out. Hey guys, uh, sorry about last night. I had a little thing going on, and I hope you guys got my email, and I'm yeah. ready to go tonight. Yeah, I got it. So did everybody get on like the, the group listserv? And so it's it's in the website. I really do appreciate you uh, you putting all that in. Uh, actually, I really don't have much experience, but I could probably do some work. I mean, you willing to learn? I'm willing to learn. Sweet, yeah. that sounds great. What's going on, Anderson? Mark's ten minutes late, but we'll we'll get into new things. So since since you missed our first group meeting, I need to set some ground rules. Guys, we need to show up on time. Five o'clock on the dot. No, everybody needs to be here at 445. If you're not on time, you're late. Second, I'll be hosting a project party at my house Friday night. Be there or be square. There's going to be free Twizzlers and energy drinks for everyone who shows up. We really need to get on this project, y'all. I was thinking everyone should be spending a minimum of four hours a day outside of class in addition to the class time the teacher allots us because that's what I've been doing and I hope that's where everybody else is. Uh -huh. So is everyone, um, is everyone in agreement? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess. Uh, I was thinking maybe we'll just grab some beer Friday night, but... No. You, you couldn't get this big of a project done in less than four hours. I mean, I know I couldn't, and I'm a professional web design student. I'm a semi-professional web design student. I'm sorry, like, I, I cannot handle how greatly I'm doing this. I have other responsibilities that I really need to take care of in my day, and I can't get away from them. It's hard enough as it is. Mark. What are you doing, like? Um, you know, like one of my buddies came over and we had to finish up a quick game. And, you know, like, Mark, the time stuff happens. I'm sorry. Have you even heard how much time he's asking us to put towards this? And well, I mean, Amy probably was having a hard day. 
who knows, but yeah, I agree with her. It's basically four hours a day, not worth it. And we don't even know if you're dedicated. We, like, I mean, like, of course I'm dedicated. I'm sorry, I just I showed up a few minutes late. A few and times. you did last time and the time before that when we were even in class trying to learn the basics. Nobody's perfect, right? Yeah. You, I, have you told him how much time we expect him if, if we're going by your guidelines? I have been spending a minimum of four hours a day outside of class on this project. So. My group is discussing things, whatever, and I guess I came with the wrong moment because Amy decided to take all her frustration out on me. I've sit down, you know, trying to get relaxed, and she talks about, like, oh, you know, are you willing to put all these hours in and whatnot? Like, I've been doing all this, and what? Well, I'm thinking in the back of my head, like, come on. Like, if you, you don't have to put that many hours in. If you decide you want to spend four hours a night, like Addison said, you can do that. Like, I spend about 10 minutes a week, but you know, that's me, that's you. And, and I just, I'm just like, wow, okay, you know what? You probably had a bad day. No need to get me involved with that or to tell me about it. Because quite frankly, you know what? I don't care. Don't do it. I think we need to just settle down a little bit. I think we're just jumping down his throat. I'm, I'm not for him showing up late, but I think we need to work together. And us fighting right now isn't going to work. But so, Mark, if you could just try and please get here on time. Or just notify us if you can't. Just be like, I'll be 10 minutes late and just really be on board. I'll try really hard to be on board. I, I really hope you mean that. Oh, well, everybody else is here except for Mark. Does anyone talk to him? It's 15 minutes late, almost 20. If you really want to I mean, do you think we might should kind of like kick him out? I mean. I think I think we should wait for him a little bit. Me might bring his stuff, but uh, if if it has to come down to it, I guess we have to. Yeah, I mean, if you don't do the work, then you don't get the grade. Yeah, I think we should just wait a little bit longer. Maybe he's just finally. Well, should we just keep trying to call him and go back to the room, or? That works for now. Because we, we, I mean, we still gotta get work done, <laughs> especially if he's not gonna be here. Because I, I think everybody's just kind of worked up, you know, like. Uh, it's a big project and everybody wants to do well on it, so I, I understand, but let's just, we understand what everybody has to do and um, we can work with that, right? I think we still have more time, so just being right. patient with everything and we'll get it done. You're really well. Alright, good. All right. It's okay. All right. It's about that time. Yeah, that's it. Can't get any more done tonight. <sighs> Alright, I'll see you guys. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Take care. Homepage, then I don't. We don't really have a flagship for our site. Yeah, but then I mean, maybe since you did talk to him about stuff, so maybe he'll. Professor, I want to talk to you about Mark. Okay. Mark is a social loafer, and he's not really pulling his own weight in the group. Amy and I have been doing the brunt of all the work, and Paul's been really influential too. But every time, every time we do anything, like set up a group meeting or assign tasks. Mark is always late, he never does the work he's supposed to, and sometimes he even brings in the wrong work and claims that he misunderstood misunderstood what's going on. We're thinking about kicking him out of the group, but we want to talk to you first. Well, I appreciate that you came in to talk to me before you decided to kick him out of the group in general. So I understand the frustrations that you and Amy and Paul and everyone in the group feel towards the social loafer because you all are pulling your weight and he's simply not pulling the weight that needs to be done towards your end goal. So I think that there are other ways to go about it than kicking Mark out of the group. Though he's a social loafer, you could maybe reassign, do some reassigning, or you could try sidestepping. Okay. So just don't result, like kicking him out would be the worst step that you could take. So try and work with him, try and see what happens, and then we can meet again all right. if he's not still pulling his weight. Okay. Well, thank you for all your help, and I'm glad I didn't have to kick him out, but I want to talk to you first. So, thank you. Thank you for coming in.